Okay, guys, so this is a totally unedited, uncut video. Uh, Firebase.studio has just dropped. I don't even know where to start with this, okay? However, I mean, Google has been cooking recently, and I have a feeling this is going to be absolutely crazy. So we're going to grab this. We're going to see what happens here. Now, the real, the real cool thing about this is that if this uses Gemini 2.5 Pro and also is connected to Firebase in some way, that's where things start to get super, super exciting, right? Okay, so what do we have here? We have Go, Python Flask, Java, .NET, Android Studio Cloud, Flutter, Angular, uh, wow, Astro, MongoDB, there's a lot of stuff here. Um, that's React plus Expo. Right, so we could make... Oh, we got Next.js too. Okay, so if you don't really know much about coding, then you might need some help here. Now, shout out to the school. Um, shout out to Nick here. He actually uh, put me onto Firebase.studio. I was, I was chilling. I was actually in the bath. And for some reason, I decided to check my school. And now I'm not in the bath. And I'm here instead making this video. But yeah, if you need a little bit of extra help with AI dev, understanding, you know, tech stacks, like you can see here, I've got some of the tech stacks that were just mentioned, Visual Studio Code, all that good stuff, then definitely check out the school community. It'll be the first link in the description of this video. Now let's just press Firebase AI sample here, um, see if this actually does anything, doesn't look like it. So let's just go with React Native plus Expo. We'll call this... Um, I don't know, to-do app. I'm probably not going to make it to-do app, but I'll just call it to-do app. It's kind of tongue-in-cheek. And we'll press create here, right? So this should create kind of a bolt.new style environment here. This looks like it's totally free as well. Um, I haven't added anything so far, so. So let's just read this. Firebase Studio is an agentic cloud-based development environment that helps you build and ship production quality full-stack AI apps including APIs, backends, frontends, mobile, and more. Firebase Studio unifies Project IDX with specialized AI agents and assistance from Gemini in Firebase to provide a collaborative workspace accessible from anywhere, containing everything you need to develop an application. You can import your existing projects or start something with templates supporting. So it's basically, it's very similar to uh, Bolt.new, it seems. However, it's made by Google and it's totally free at the moment. Okay, so it looks like this has now created a um, an expo uh, and React Native environment here. So I'm guessing if we press Firebase Studio here. Okay, so what do you host the web app with Firebase? Okay, really cool. Deploy to Cloud Run. Add Gemini at Gemini API so you can automate adding um, generative AI features to your app. That's pretty damn cool. Okay, so we now have it running. It's very similar to bolt.new. Um, might actually be using the exact same system as bolt.new. Okay, so it looks like in order to make something, we have to press this Gemini thing here. And I'm just gonna say, make me a to-do app. What is this, system UI not responding, what? Okay, so it looks like this is the React Native vanilla page that you would see on, um, when, when you install Expo on anything, right? And we have the Android here, which doesn't seem to be working uh, for, for whatever reason. Okay, no, it, it seems to be loading here, actually. This looks like it's, I uh, know, oh it's, it's not responding. Okay, so for now, we'll just say make me, to, uh, make me a to-do app. I apologize for using the to-do app example. I just want to um, see how this works, basically. Okay, sure, let's create a file. I have absolutely no experience with Expo or making uh, mobile apps, just so you know. So, I mean, if this works pretty quickly and pretty well, that would be pretty interesting for sure. Doesn't seem to be... Okay, so it looks like we're struggling already, but I think I might know why. So if we go on Gemini here, you can see built-in Gemini model. I'm going to actually change this to 2.5 experimental. Yes, this costs money, but I don't have time to be pissing around. So, Okay, so we've set this to experimental now. 
and we'll just um, bug fix a little bit. I don't think this would have been necessary from the beginning if I had just set Gemini. I didn't uh, 2.5. I didn't realize you could actually uh, change the model. So we're getting this error here, um, and you can actually set this model here. So I'm going to put custom model ID. I'm going to set this model and then Control S to save that, and then send this this error. Send it this error again. Uh, it was using some shit model before. Like we may as well use the, the better model here, right? So we'll update the file here that might have fixed the error. There we go. Okay, so this is the to-do app again. Sorry to use this as an example. I was just curious. And yeah, hello. <laughs> Make a to-do app. That's my to-do, right? So we'll add that. Okay, nice. So it does work. Um, very, very simple. I understand that. But it's just really cool because you can make more examples, right? So in this case, I've made a to-do app on React Native, right? And then I just want to see why this isn't working. So I'll just I'll just say the Android isn't working. It just keeps crashing. Then we'll send this picture. But like, if we go back to Firebase.studio, right? And we just go through this whole thing again. I guess it's logged, yeah, it's logged into my account. Okay, that makes sense. So this, as far as I know, this is the only way that you can actually do this. So now you can do all of these different um, formats, all of these different types of apps, right? So Android Studio Cloud, Flutter, which I believe makes um, apps as well, Angular, Next.js, right, which is really cool, Node Express, perfect, Gemini API, GenKit, Astro, MongoDB, and React Native. Okay, nice. So we actually have the to-do app also on mobile. This is a fucking game changer, guys, because I've been wanting to make mobile apps for ages. This is just a simple to-do app, right? But just think about how far you can go with this. You could make games, you could make seriously complicated applications connected to Firebase itself. I'm guessing it has prior knowledge and prior documentation of Firebase. This is an absolute game changer, guys. The fact that you can use Gemini 2.5 Pro inside here as well is really, really cool. The reason I'm so excited about this is because SEO, it's not, it's not dying in my opinion, it's not dead, but it's, there's going to be a seismic shift in SEO. I think right now the real way to make money is to make phone apps that do things like edit images using um, DALI or GPT-40 or whatever, all these different things, right? all these different AI applications. That's where the money is right now. The money, I agree with people when they say, when they say the money's not in WordPress websites necessarily, although I do still think there's money there. Money is here. Add ads to this, add AdSense, make it a paid app, make something really, really cool and something really, really useful and just see how far you can go with it. So right now, Firebase is in a, a Firebase Studio is in preview. It says prototype an app with AI. It doesn't say build an app with AI. I think this is not very far away from being something very, very cool and very, very interesting. Please, AI companies, don't release anything else today. I'm very, very tired. I don't want to keep having to be in front of the computer. It's a beautiful night, beautiful evening. But yeah, just having these frameworks here is very, very interesting, very, very cool. And I think this is mainly geared towards making apps. I think right now what I would do if I were you is I would use this to make an AI mobile app using the Gemini API. I think I will leave the video there, guys. This is pretty cool as well, actually. Definitely check this out. This is free. It's in preview. Um, you obviously have to pay for um, Gemini in some cases. I'm not, I don't exactly know how that works. Thanks for watching, guys. If you're watching all the way to this, the end of this video, you are an absolute legend, and I'll see you very, very soon with some more content. Peace out.